I want you to uh, uh, teach them my rosary of the seven sorrows and about my my sorrows with Jesus, my son. And so um, she taught her how to pray the rosary and then uh, to tell her about uh, her participation in our redeeming uh, with her son Jesus, which she did, and she preached till she died. Um, uh, the teaching people of these, the rosary of we are about to pray um, and um, so uh, even uh, to this day uh, Mary is encouraging us to remember uh, the sorrows as the uh, prophet uh, uh, prophesied forget not the uh, sorrows of your mother forget not so anyway, um, this, uh, uh, I gave you a little background on this on this powerful rosary, and it consists of um, uh, uh, the Our Father and the seven Aves on each of the traditionally outstanding sows of Our Lady. Uh, she had more than one, uh, more than seven, but these are the uh, traditionally outstanding ones, and we'll announce those as we go along. I'm going to let whoever leads the mystery uh, take the rosary. We'll pass it around, and it's a, a beautiful uh, rosary she gave us uh, because um, the medals tell the mystery each time. So even if you've been drinking wine like Father Rookie today, you won't, I can't go wrong because there is the mystery each time on that medal. And uh, so you can't go wrong. Well, we um, uh, begin, uh, then we, uh, by the way, anybody who's ever been to our healing services before was put on the shelf eight years ago. Oh, yeah. They've been there, and so it's Tony and, and Benny and our old timers, and so on. Well, we always uh, started with the, this rosary, which we're about to pray with you today, and then the Mass, and then a benediction, uh, exposition of Blessed Sac. Oh, we had a, a time of um, witnessing where people got up and said, I was. I had cancer, I was blessed, no more cancer, I was blind, now I see. Still going on, even in spite of my being put on the shelf, I've been blessing people just individually. Like in Medjugorje recently, we've been blessed uh, two born uh, blind uh, children, uh, girls, and one a young man from uh, all the way from Lithuania, this, this family was, and when the father witnessed this with healing uh, of their blindness, he became a practicing Catholic again. Praise God! That's the big one. I always tell people, your big, um, biggest uh, healing is not the one on the physical part, which we're going to die anyway, aren't we? So uh, no matter. Um, what? But um, if we are healed interiorly in our hearts, that that's forever, for uh, eternity. So that's the big healing, and that's what he had, the father of these little girls. Anyway, <coughs> uh, then, um, so she's still uh, going about uh, helping us and everywhere, and especially nowadays in Medjugorje. Well, um, so uh, now this rosary she gave us, it, it begins with an act of contrition. Now, any act of contrition will do, but this is one we Servites have been using over the years, so I'll start with that. And then um, I'll ask uh, maybe Betty or, or uh, the, the head of the household here, is uh, she here? Uh, would you, uh, let's, she's used to it, and then, and then I'll let the, you do the next one, okay? Or, or unless you can want to start. It's just the Our Father and the Sieben Heiligen Schmerzen.
I mean, oh, I'm getting my German mixed up here. This is Italy, not Germany. Okay, I spent six years in Italy and five in Deutschland, so I get mixed up. A mixed up kid, anyway. Anyway, uh, so let us make our uh, our intentions first. She's promised the moon, sort of thing, for those who remember her sorrows. And so let us make our intentions and then we'll begin with the act of contrition.